Greetings, fellow traveler. I want to remind you that while you're on your journey, you'll have moments of reflection where you realize that there are people in your life that you really cherish. They may not be around you anymore. They may not be on this plane anymore. They may have been people that you were only around temporarily. But take a moment to honor those people. Send them love, light, grace. Because sometimes people see that thing in you that you don't even see in yourself. You still may not see it, and that's okay. That's what the journey's about. But when you can recognize those certain people who say the right thing to you, to get you to change, shift perspective, or to see yourself in a different light, really appreciate that. You know, I have said before, don't praise the messenger, but you have to realize that God uses messengers and he can only use the ones that have certain tools in their toolbox. So if somebody does give you a kind word, somebody does something for you that helps you shift even the most minute aspect of your personality or your beliefs for the better, be grateful for that. In the world we live in now, we can be so convoluted with information and things that we don't even need into our consciousness. But there's no way to really stop that. The world is its own beast. It's its own wilderness. But when you come across those that really give you an inspiring word or give you a helping hand in any shape, form, or fashion, be grateful. Send them love. Even send love to your enemies. But for those that you can really just look back and say, you know what? I'm grateful for that moment. Hey, honor that. Because that's beautiful. I mean, those, those kind of occurrences come a dime a dozen. So when you can really do that, it really helps you out as well because it puts you in a better state of gratitude. It puts you in a better state of, yo, God was looking out for me then too. It's a beautiful thing. Me in particular, I had a client at one time who told me, uh, it was quite personal, but he told me something that stuck with me. And we had various conversations we had a lot of different topics that we would explore and he didn't judge me for where I was in life status wise he was in a whole nother league that didn't matter though he talked to me as a human being and I talked to him the same but he said some things in me that really stuck to me like he really really got me thinking he shared ideas he shared visions and <laughs> I watched them come true got the neighbors out there making noise uh, but take time to be grateful for those things because even now I haven't seen this guy in over a decade but he always holds a place in my heart him and his family because they didn't mean me harm they spoke to me as a child of God and nothing less so when you have those moments reflect on them embrace them appreciate them know that there will be more in the future there may be something happening to you today but really thank God for it because it's beautiful when you can see it. And sometimes we have to look back to connect the dots. With that said, be blessed and don't forget to smile.